Hello, Frank Bunyo speaking from Citolog. I'm going to show you how to set up a discount, a set of discount prices for many products at once uh, within uh, PrestaShop using Presta Pricing 4.1. So when uh, Presta Pricing is started, uh, usually you, you see here your list of categories. So let's suppose I'm going to select two categories, iPod and Portables. Uh, in order to set up discount for th all the product of those two categories. After you have selected the categories, just select the gears here in order to list all the product belonging to those two categories. Here they are. And I'm going to select all the product using this button here, a red square. And let's say I'm going to remove the MacBook V2 because I don't want the discount to be applied to this one. So here I'm going to apply a discount to all product of those two categories except one. After you have done this, uh, here you can see um, three tabs here, combination, image, specific price and product features. I'm going to use the specific price and quantity discount tabs here. Um, once you are in this tab, uh, you need to click on this second gear here in order to display in the table below uh, the existing specific price and quantity discount. Here we are, so we can see that for those few products we already have sums, so I'm going to remove them for the purpose of the demonstration. So you can select them all using this button and click on this button here to delete them all together. Here we are. So now, let's suppose I want to apply uh, from let's say the 15 of January to the uh, let's say 20 of January a 10% discount on all those products. Pretty easy. You just go there, you set up your parameters so 10% discount, you select percentage here and then you set up your dates. Uh, it's already done in fact. 15 and then selecting 21 uh, in order to, to end in the 20 end of night. And then you just click on this button, and then immediately you have the same discount, 10% apply to all the products selected, all in once. Let's suppose now I want to apply another percentage, but let's say 20%, for our, let's say the 21th of January and the end of January. Here we are. And then as you can see, all product here now I have two uh, discount rules with a specific date. You can do the same uh, using, using the same mechanism. You can specifically uh, mention a quantity, so apply uh, what we call a quantity discount. You can do it for one product, many product at once, anything. I mean, you can uh, let's say specify the currency, specify a, a country, uh, a group of people to apply. To apply to. Now that the discounts are active, you just you need as well to remember uh, on the 15th of January to um, have let's say the on sales logo being displayed on the product pages. So this is done here using this on sales column. Just need to pick to to select uh, or let's say to check the checkbox like it is right now. Here I'm unchecking and checking again. If this column is not visible here, just go to the column list tab here and you need to ensure that it is it is selected here on sales. So you click on and click here and then you say you click on save setting in order to have a column being shown. To change a specific price or a discount for one specific product is pretty easy. Just select the product. Let's suppose, for example, I'm going to select the iPod Nano here. And then you can see the two discount prices here. Just select the one you would like to change. For example, I'm going to change the 20% here into a 22%. That's it. Leave a, leave a line and then it's saved automatically. Uh, so the change here is applied. Oh, sorry, put 20. 
it's a bit too much. So 22%. The 22% is applied now only to iPod Nano. Let's check it. I'm selecting a second product here. You can see 22% for the iPod, product number one, and then 20% still for the Shuffle, product number two. Using the same mechanism, you can apply quantity discount. Let's do it for the MacBook V2. Let me say I want to apply a discount when we are in dollars only. Uh, from a quantity of 5, so when customer is purchasing 5 products, I want him to get a 30% discount on any period of time. So no limitation. So just need to delete the dates here. And I'm applying it. Okay, this is done. Let me show you now how to duplicate a quantity discount or a specific price from one product to many other products. It's really, really easy. For example, I would like to apply this quantity discount here to all the product here. The only thing you need to do is to select the line. And what you can see is that the box here automatically fill by the same values. Now that this is done, I'm selecting all the product except the source product, so I remove a Mac v MacBook V2 and then you, you just need now to, to, to click on again this uh, this button to have this or those value here being applied to all the product. As you can see now all the product here have a quantity discount from 5 quantity of 30% any dates. With PrestaShop version 1.2 and 1.3, the specific prices uh, did not exist. Uh, so let's see how to reach the same result with PrestaShop 1.2 or 1.3. First of all, as you can see, uh, when I'm selecting a product here, uh, you can use, you can still use the same tool here to display, edit, and create quantity discount. This was still uh, existing, this was already existing with those versions of PrestaShop. But as you can see, uh, the currency country group and the other box here from 2 are great because again, specific price did not exist in those versions. So you can create quantity discount prices this way using this button here, same process, but you cannot create specific price. So, how to do it? How to set up a, a discount? Uh, the way to do it is by using directly the product table. You need to ensure that within the column, different column here, you have the let's say discount price being selected. So on sales price here. You select it, you apply, and then what you will see is that now you have here your on sales price being displayed and then some of the column like discount in value, discount in percentage, perform and two dates. So it's pretty easy now to apply a discount from a date to another date by editing either directly the lines here, for example, let me set up, let me change this 5% here into a 7% and then I could change the date as well uh, to change the date period. If the two dates are equal, it means that uh, the discount will apply indefinitely. In order to clone or to duplicate a discount from one product to many others, it's pretty easy, different way to do it. Uh, for example, let's suppose I would like to have this 10% here being cloned on those two other lines. Just need to select them, you do a, a right click, and then you select copy paste these cells into the select cells of this column. Confirm, and then you have your 10% apply. You do the same on the, the date eventually, and then you have the same discount applied to the same period on those three products.